Hey guys, so I'm back to do yet another box opening video. So as you can see on the box, this is my doll Pam order and there's two dolls in here. I don't know if this is like one big box or if they just taped two boxes together, but we're gonna find out. Uh, yeah, okay, it's just one big box. I think, I think. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not really sure. Oh, that's my address. Okay. Alright. Yeah, it's just one big box, so that's fine. And there's all these little foam squishies. So, that's the other box. And my invoice from Dolk, which is where I ordered them from. Okay. So, I have two. <laughs> this is exciting like slightly closer so that you guys can see okay so they're basically like the same doll <laughs> well no it's two different skulls but they're the same like line of doll I guess but I couldn't decide which one I liked more so I just got them both I ordered this last year <laughs> and it was supposed to get shipped I think in like end of February early March but that's when like the whole like COVID thing started and so they only just managed to ship them which is fine like I understand like I'm not angry plus I was in like the process of moving so it wasn't really that big of a deal so there's one box. I'm just gonna get the wrapping off the second box too. So that we can get into them. I'm excited to see how big these boys are because I think they're somewhere in between like an MSD size and a USD size. I'm not like entirely sure. I hope my babies survived. All right, which one shall we do first? Let's do this one because it's literally right in front of me. Ooh, okay, so it's got like these cool magnetic pieces. Oh, and everything just fell out. All right, so this looks like some kind of instruction and this is the COA. All right. Now I'm gonna do it like this so you guys can see the reveal. Oh, and it's covered in bubble wrap. I'm trying my best. All right. Okay. Ooh, okay. So he comes with two different types of horns. So there's like the white one and then like a clear one. So they're the exact same, but just different, different resins. Okay. Oh my goodness. Oh, he's in here. He's really, oh my god, his hands. They're so pretty. Okay, let's just, let's just get him out of there. Okay, and then we'll get a little bit closer. My head's, my head's cut off. Okay. Right. Oh, so pretty. I just have to do this very gently because he's so, so tiny. And then let's get this back in here and do some cutting, some precision. Oh god, these wings. Oh my god. Wow, this is a really interesting size. It's like not YoSD or MSD. It's like way too slim to be a YoSD, but like not small enough, if that makes sense. <laughs> oh my goodness. Wow, okay. This is really pretty. Look at him. Oh. Yes. And like, these wings are insane. Oh wow. They have like a mechanism so that they like stick and they can actually like be posed outwards. 
Wow. Wow. Let's see if I can get his horn on. Where did I put it? I wish that these dolls had hoops. I think that that would have made them that much cooler. Oh, so pretty. Look at that. He's got his little unicorn horn. Oh my god. These are so, so unique. I love them. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, there's dolly number one. We'll put him right there. And I really wish that they sent me eyes. <laughs> like, not cool. I guess they just didn't. Yeah, it's kind of annoying because, like, these dolls were expensive. And I really just, even if it was just, like, shitty, like, acrylic eyes, I think it would have been nice if they sent something. All right. Now doll number two, and it's gonna be the same, so I'm just gonna open it like this. So, again, instructions and COA. Let me get it on this side so that you guys can see. And it's the same thing, he's also got like the two horns. All right, I'm just also going to Direct him carefully out of there. Put the box right there. And this one I got in the pink skin. Oh my god, it looks really white on camera too. But it definitely is a different color. I will show them side by side after I'm done unwrapping this one. Okay. Just very, very gentle. So gentle. Oh my god, their hands are so fucking pretty. Love it. Alright. And then some gentle precision work here. Oh my gosh. So cute. So, so freaking cute. Oh my god, he's so adorable. There he is. This is this one. Oof. Oh. I'm glad I got this one in the pink. I think his face is just like so sweet. And my light keeps flickering because I have ghosts. Where did I put the horns again? I think I'm gonna put the white horn on this one. But yeah, I think it would have been cool if they gave them like a hoof, like a hoof option because they're unicorns, right? So like they should have hooves if they were just angels. I get that they didn't have hoops, but because they're unicorns, I think they should have had hoops. I don't know. Maybe I'll make them hooves or like get some just to just to push them over the edge. But yeah, look, he's so cute. Yeah, he's so pretty. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. All right. So here's the two beside each other oh my god this one's wing is like really just really oh they're so cute so yeah you can see they're like different resin colors this is a pink and this one's a white i'm glad that i got them to be slightly different they're so pretty oh my god oh my god these wings these wings are just very heavy <laughs> so i have no idea what i'm gonna do with these boys I don't have names for them. I don't really have a plan, like, story-wise. I just thought they were really, really pretty. Wow. The, like, look at those wings. They're so crazy. I love it. My plan is to just get them stands and put them. I have, you can see behind me, this glass cabinet. I bought a second one, and it's going to go right beside. So I'm going to get them little stands, and they can live in there. Because these are like display dolls, like I am not dressing these boys up or anything. Well, I mean like I'm dressing them up. They're not going to just be naked forever, but <laughs> they are probably just only going to have like one outfit. Oh my god, I like this one's face so much. I just want to look at this guy again. Yeah, like I just really couldn't decide which one I liked more. These are so cute. They just remind me of like Zoom boys a little bit. They're just such an interesting size. Like they really don't go with any of the dolls that I currently have. Cause I, 
I only have SDs and MSDs right now. I think I have one doll, actually, that they might be in proportion with. I have, like, one of those planet doll, like, little 30 centimeter dolls. Or maybe less, I don't remember. But yeah, I think they might go with that boy. I'm sorry about my light. There's ghosts. I swear to you. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, these are my two boys. If you have name suggestions, oh my god, ugh, they're just so, and they're, they're, it's on again. But yeah, if you have name suggestions or like character ideas, because these, these two are like a blank slate. They really, really have nothing. First of all, they're really pretty. But yeah. So I'm just going to give you one last close up of this boy. So pretty. So, so pretty. And one last close up of this boy. I was like really worried about how I'd feel about these, but I absolutely love them. They're so cute. They're so, so cute. Ghosts again, sorry. And then this boy. One last close up. My light. There's ghosts. <laughs> yeah, those are my two new doll pen boys. I don't have anything else coming in the mail for a while. I don't have anything else on order right now, but I do plan to make more videos about some of the dolls that I've gotten in since I last talked to you guys, and there's quite a lot. So yeah, I plan to make a video about those, um, and that's going to be like some stuff to look forward to in the future but thanks so much for watching this box opening video and i will talk to you guys again shortly bye bye